Hey there, I am JP and we are playing some more of Fishing Adventure. Now at this moment the game is on sale for 69 cents. Nice! And we are going to do some quest, which in the last episode we actually unlocked Germany. And for today we are going to start off with this first one, which we're just going to catch 10 fish. And those 10 fish need to have a total weight of 5 kilos. Let's do that already. I don't see any requirements needed, so... Ooh, I do see something else though. So let's just go to our F2, which is not what I wanted to do. Uh, I'll guess F1, and then we need to do it via the store. The thing is, I got one more of these left, so I'm just gonna switch this off. Full bread, and then C. Can, can I get out? No? Out? Maybe F1? Okay, there we go. Yeah, and then see what what we can catch with what we just have. Now let me just find a cozy little place because we have also figured out already how we could buy some extra time. And you know what? In this this case, I like oh like this spot a lot. So let's do some chill fishing. Now I also have to mention after this episode, I'm going to do one more. I want to keep it with five episodes because we also have fish the ultimate fishing adventure one and the ultimate fisher adventure two i'm also going to play five episodes of these two other games and then i would just like to see what i like am i liking this one more or one of the other two and then i'll just play a little more and of course it also depends on what you guys like but you know, so far so good. Alright, we got this chop. Let's just please it. And then throw in another one. And just relax for a minute. There we go. Let's see what this will be. And I might just do a little bit of cut editing where there's a little bit of waiting. Just cut that out. We're just going to... I'm just going to show you the parts where I'm reeling the fish in. So you also maybe have a little guess what I'm catching right now because this boy is fighting it. It's a one kilo. So maybe this would be a good idea. Everything um, what is below or above a kilo, I'm going to throw back. Everything that is below, we're just going to sell. <laughs> so there will only be heavy fish in there, even though I don't think the game works like that. Always be a random type of deal. And in the real world, you mostly do it the other way around. You want to keep the babies in the water and get the old ones out of it. Did I? Oh, I need to catch eight more pieces. I wanted to say. Maybe the developer needs to change it like... Oh, you got two out of eight. Or 2 out of 10 in this case. I'll just stop being a dumb dumb. I think it will be the second one that's going to happen. <laughs> Alright. It's always going to be a little bit of getting to know the area. Getting to know the type of fish once you are on a new spot. And you can see which one are the tougher ones. Which are the lesser tougher ones. Okay, we have a chop, a chop. That is okay. Let's just do it the other way around. We're going to release everything below and sell everything above. It's a little more of fish shell. Wow, I didn't have to do a lot for that. All right, what are you going to be? A Crucian carp, which is less than a kilo. So, I'm gonna go back. And it seems like bread is kind of an okay thing to use. And is of course very good because it's an unlimited source we have. And which I'm still surprised that you can, you know, throw it into the trash can in your inventory. But there are no pieces of bread buy in the store, which worries me a little bit. Oh, we got a classic roach. Alright, it seems like we have reached the goal of the amount of kilos. Now we just need five more fish. The objectives don't seem to be too tough. Even with, you know, running out of time, you can buy some time, so it's okay, I guess. 
Now the one thing I do want to mention, uh, even though the other games, the other two might be looking graphical here and there, a little bit better maybe. I am not going to base my feedback on you know, the graphics. It's it's all about the gameplay, what is important for me. I mean, it can look very good and then play very bad. But it can also play very good and it doesn't look very good. So I'd rather, you know, have a nice fun gameplay. Things explain it to me. And yeah, I, I, I'm going to base it on that. You should look at this light post. Like it got, kind of got the size of this tree. Maybe it is illusion. I mean, if you look at the background trees, all the, the one in the, all the furthest back, you can just tell how it's like cut off with the scissors or whatever. That, that doesn't bother me too much. There are tricks for developers to actually do that different, um, but it costs a little bit of work. Let me see, I need to cast it. Like you have the, the, the tree picture, which is a very green colorful. And then you have like this darker part coming up. The darker part coming up looks a bit better. If it's about how it's cut out. They should just take that picture. And double that in the background. Change the colors a little bit. Then it already looks better. I mean, in, in overall, everything what is up front, you know, it looks good. One little playful fish. Ah, uh, he's definitely gonna go back. Not really catching any big ones anymore. Got two more fishes to go. Six more minutes. Um, but also, I would like to say that I have no idea how many people are working on this game. It could be very well that just one person, or maybe two, three. So, and, and developing a game alone, or with two people, can take a lot of work if you choose for a certain graphical looks and animations and that kind of deal. Not a playful one. Mm-hmm. So far, so good. Hey, going to easily make it. Just need one more fish. And if you ask me what would I like to see different in this game, holy moly, this guy had some much coffee. I would like to see that you can access the store and the inventory via the main menu, or at least once you go to the quest menu, the first prepare for the quest. Rather than having to start the quest and then being able to go to the store and inventory. Alright, and do we want to start? Let me see, what was the button? Oh yeah, for the people not know, if you hold control, and then you can move your mouse and then you can click no. Why no? Well, we want to know what is coming up, right? We need two chops. And uh, we're 13 minutes, which is a lot. So something fishy is going on. And now, like I said, I want to prepare for that. I want to see if there is bait or something special for these chubbies. Uh, so in this case, what I then would find more handy to take my time is just to go to the map, right? And in this map, and just take it easy because I think once you start a quest, it is going to do the timer, even though it here. I'm not sure about that though. Okay, chubbies. What do chubbies like to eat? Now, instead of just figuring it out here, let's just go here. Chops. Okay, chops like caster. Now we also, I do believe it was this. No, chops don't like this, chops like that. That's a lot of money. Chop like cherry. Chops definitely like cherry. So let's just take a little look. I think yeah, this is cheaper stuff. So I'll just buy two. Why not? Let's just always buy two. I also wonder about the inventory. Will I get like a little scroll thingy or is this everything we can have? In this case, 
Let's put the cherry there. Let's take a look at this. Ooh, the condition is 21. Now, I would like to take a look then at the hooks. And at hooks. I. Oh, yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, okay. The first one is. Has a very long health that you use, and then the second one you need to buy. And I wonder if it works the same, but you can just buy multiply. Okay, let me just see something here. Then this guy is a sprout number 16. Four, four, 12, 10, 1. I don't understand the numbers in here. I definitely not. Okay, this is not for a job. Oh, okay. Uh, in this case, let's just... Man, that's expensive. Pipe narrow bait. Bait hook. Live bait hook. Bait hook. Okay, so there is a lot more to take a look at. So this is narrow bait. Then let's take a look at... Doesn't say anything. Practice nest 35%, 30%. 25 okay i see i see then i have to go to the shop because yeah it doesn't really say anything though all right let me just buy a couple of these just in case and i can just quickly switch it off if this thing gets broken right kind of looks the same this 100 i think it's just five times this guy type of idea uh, in this case I have is this just forever or what 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 is going on? Oh I think it will count the meters down maybe because in the shop Yeah it count the meters down that's fine uh which I have left Okay I can deal with that now let's take a look at reels we have this reel Mm, condition 100% so this guy isn't going to go down uh, Ooh, look at this strength condition it can do a little bit more level 3 mm. watch and buy this guy which cost 3300 hmm I'm not sure if I really need that just yet so in this case let's just Go with the flow, right? Let's go out of this stuff. Yes, now we can go to the quest. And now we can start catching two chops within 13 minutes. Go here today. All right, chops. Seems like a lot of time for two fishies, so... I wonder how this is going to go with the specialized bait that I'm having. Hmm, I all of a sudden remember the weather condition. I'm going to... Uh, mm, I wonder, <laughs> is there any information somewhere that will say, okay, this fish will be more active during this time of the day and weather? Ooh, come on now. It takes a very long time and... Ooh, this is a real challenge though. All right. Hmm, just coffee. Okay, let that be a chop. Let this be a chop, please. Thank you. This is a common carp. Ah, you seem to like be bad guys. I'm going to sell your ass. Ah, the rain stops. Wonder this will. Make me catch fish faster. I just wanted to say it like... Does the rain not annoy fish or whatever? All those drops hitting with hundreds and hundreds of them at the same time under the water. I mean, if you go to a fishing store, they always tell you... Do not... Um, knock your fingers or whatever onto the glass because the fish don't like that. Come on now. Ay ay ay, this, yeah, <laughs> they definitely added a difficulty to this. And I guess fishing is just like being a sniper. Why do they have patience? Alright, we got our first job 
And you know what? You're gonna go back because you're below one kilo. And let's just imagine it will increase our chance to catch it again. Alright, get over here. Let's see. Will this be another chubby fish? Ah, it's a playful one. It's another chubby fish. Wow. Uh, very good. And holy moly, this thing is almost two kilos. Okay, let's just first sell this guy. And then... No. I don't want to go to the next quest because I would like to know what on earth is it going to be. Two breams. Oh, wait. Oh, eight kilos. Holy moly. You know, we might need to buy a new fishing rod in the next episode. But in this case, I'm just going to take a little look what we all have. Uh, yeah, we have this guy. This guy has a strength of four kilos. We, got, we, we are getting into the bigger fish, so... Which, at this moment, that the one we just got was almost two kilos or whatever. Which this guy has a strength of two kilos, so we are touching the edge of breaking this thing into multiplied pieces. It is definitely going to be handy. Definitely.